Hey everybody, it's GB, and today we're looking at the Esquire Mini from Harden Carden. The Esquire Mini sports a sophisticated design, superb sound with no strings attached. It has a beautiful unibody design, beautiful fit and finish. It's just simply gorgeous. It comes in four colors, black, silver, gold, and brown. And on the back, it has genuine leather to match the color choice that you decide on. Um, it touts an eight hour battery life, and it also, as a bonus, can charge your device while it's in use. Now, this device plays music and handles voice calls via two four watt speakers. It also has a dual microphone design for its conferencing system. Looking at the front of the device, you can see it sports the Harman Kardon logo in the metallic gold print. Um, it has a gold metallic speaker mesh grill. And on the back, you have an integrated kickstand, which is very handy and tucks right away so it makes the slim profile easily able to slide into a suit pocket or your pants pocket for maximum portability. Now you can see looking closely um, around the edges, we have a very nice chamfered edge design, kind of similar to maybe the iPhone 5 or 5S. Um, really looks great on this device. Um, they did a really good job of putting it together. There's a small LED right under the top of the speaker grill just to give you a status light. And again, another look here at the uh, genuine leather back. It's coordinated and color toned depending on the color choice that you choose. Um, this is a really small portable device and I cannot say enough about the fit and finish. I think anyone's going to be really satisfied with that. Now, one of the main features of this device is simply its conferencing system. It has a dual microphone array, and I found it to capture some really, really crisp vocals and deliver vocals to the person on the other line um, and had no complaints while testing its conference capabilities. I quickly compared it to my Bose SoundLink Mini just to kind of get a quick comparison of the sound. And as these are both stellar sounding devices, the one thing that I'll go ahead and tell you is that obviously because of the added cabinet size in the Bose, you're going to get a little bit of extra bass response. And I think that would be expected. But on both, clarity are key features and they just sound great. One thing you're going to lose with the Bose because of its bigger size is simply the ability to put it in a pocket and carry it with you everywhere. Now here we have the Esquire Mini paired up with my second generation Moto X. Just for a size comparison, I was really surprised um, that these devices are pretty much the same size. When you put them side by side, um, they pretty much match up in everything except for thickness. You can see the Esquire Mini is just a little bit thicker, and that's probably just to maximize the cabinet space for the speakers, just so you can get the little bit of bass response that it has. Now let's go ahead and take a listen, and, and I'll let you hear some of the quality sound that comes out of this device. Now for my sound test, I used the Zoom H5's internal stereo capsules to capture sound from the Esquire Mini. And again, I can't tell you just how impressed I was with the clarity and depth that comes out of such a small device. It's really impressive. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review of the Harman Kardon Esquire Mini. Um, it's overall a great device. It looks good. It's designed for someone who's really into a stylish appearance with great functionality in conferencing and both music via Bluetooth. If you guys enjoyed the video, please hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe.